que sácate del camino! ¡Joder, mierda! ¡Oh! at it again reactors with another reaction to black mirror season six we got episode four two episodes left but this episode is titled mazy day i've already reeled in the first three episodes be sure to go check those out joan is awful enjoyed that episode those reactions episodes one through three they will be linked at the end screen of this video, but you can find them in the description down below. But episode two, Locke Henry really, really enjoyed. But that last episode, episode three, Beyond the Sea, I was, I predicted that one all the way up to the point, and then the rug was pulled right from under me, totally shocked. But be sure to go reel in those three episodes. But we got episode four, enough talk. Let's dive in, like this video, because it's time to read it in. That's right. Tom and Katie have issued a statement mm -hmm. naming it's their Domino. New baby Suri. That's Zazie. Right, folks, Suri Cruz. Word is she's not going to be in Deadpool 3, which sucks. They're bringing everyone else back, but not her. Yeah, JP, I've been sitting here for two hours, but there's no sign of them. If I ever let you down, I'll let you know. Oh, she's paparazzi. Hey, can I talk to you? Uh-oh. I can pay. You gotta get out of there. <laughs> For those pictures, you're killing me. Please. Is she paparazzi? Uh-oh. Got him out! <laughs> what just happened? TV's Justin Camley enjoys a little afternoon delight with a male buddy. Ah. Got him coming out of the closet. We're coming out the front door. Three each. Ooh, it's just one thing. Hey, oh, oh, come on, you gotta keep the song going. Really delicate sinuses. And when you fry garlic and ginger, it just makes the whole apartment a little acrid. Oh, my. Yeah, I'll open the window, Nathan. Thank you so much. Yeah. Fun roommate. Mazy Day. We have our title. And we have celebrity news breaking right now breaking here news. in Hollywood. Justin Canley has been found dead in his Hollywood Hills home. TMZ are reporting. That's the guy. An apparent. Oh, oh he took himself out. Broke that Justin had been oh. cheating on his long-term girlfriend with another man. Oh, you did that to him. <sighs> yeah, she's paparazzi. Sad as shit, Bo, but it's not your fault. Hey, Danny Ramirez. He was good in Nope. Wait. Never mind. No, he was in Falcon and Winter Soldier. That's who that is. He's the new Falcon. My limo guy says he's got Sidney Alberti in the back. Sidney yeah, Alberti. Sidney yeah, Alberti. I don't like paparazzi. Sidney! Sidney! Come on, come on, come on! Jesus. Looks like Ariana Grande. Sidney! This way you. Ooh! I love your steak! That's wrong. I think she's officially seeing how bad of a job she has. They don't care. Paparazzis, they don't care. They just care about the next shot. That's all they care about. Making a quick buck. They don't care about the people that they have, you know, in their lens. I think she might uh, have to, you know, switch jobs. Mazy day. Like, um, like, um, Abby. Going over her lines. What the hell is that? Is that drugs? Shrooms? Looks like it. Uh oh. Ooh. She's off, she's on drugs, and she's driving. Focus on the road. You should not be behind the wheel. Look at that. Oh, this is not good. It's not good. It's not good. Oh, God. She just hit someone. Shit. 
she hit a person. Crazy, she's on drugs and she instantly like wakes up. Wow, yo. Who did she hit? Hit and run. Wow. Someone just has to look at her car and just sees like, that's no fender bender. You hit someone. She's a celebrity too. Oh. Throw this closed. I go around. What did he, what did he say? They found man in the road. Oh, she hit a man. They think hit and run. Yeah, hit and run for sure. But she knew that. It's been two whole weeks. Maisie Day with a hit and run. Abruptly left the set of the third installment of the franchise. No one has seen it. This is really hard for me. Okay, what now, dude? I'm not good at confrontation, so my therapist suggested that I use cue cards. <laughs> what is going on? Your share of the rent is late. Ooh. And I have noticed groceries disappearing from my clearly marked personal shelf in the fridge. She's, she already knows where this is leading to. And while I truly value our friendship, Nathan. please. <laughs> I'll get the money. Meaning she has to get the shot. Gotta pay that rent somehow. You need the shot, not just, you know, a shot. Time to destroy someone else's life. But maybe a life that, you know, needs to be destroyed because she did a hit and run. So why are you here? To get you back in the game. Thought that maybe you could um, help me with something. Help you with what? Maisie Day. Yeah, he knows something. She got kicked off the movie set two weeks ago, flew home, and no one's seen her since. And so everybody's just cool with leaving her alone then. Not him. Nick's offering 30K for the first photo of her. Wow, $30,000. Still keep in touch with your snitch? I took his number off my phone. If you happen to find that you wrote it somewhere, let me know. I'm guessing that snitch is, you know, well in the industry of Hollywood. Hey, JP. Hey, stranger. Oh, she found the number, I guess. Food delivery. Oh, um, I think I have some money in my purse. It's OK. Mr. G said, while you're a guest in his house, he's left money to cover everything. She saw her. Mmm, she saw. What year is this, yo? The tabloids look old, too. Maisie Day's a fan, huh? <laughs> she says she orders here every week? Mm-hmm. She so does. Saw her yesterday. Look at that. She's staying at some, like, producer's house. This episode is moving fast. <laughs> Back in the game, next thing you know, she's pulling up to her crib, about to take the shot and ruin her life. But she already ruined her life. You know, hit and run. That's a no-no. <laughs> oh, she didn't see the guy's face? Miss Day? She's still going through it. Oh, she just destroyed the whole place. Look at that, man. Paparazzi, they just be camping out there. Hey, life of a celebrity, man. You gotta deal with this stuff. First step is to recognize that you're not in control of this. That it has taken you over. I've arranged a place that we could take you private out of town for just for a few days. I wonder if they know, you know what she does. Can you get me better? What's about getting you through tonight? You gotta confess. That's the and only then way. the next night. Okay. Gotta get that shot. They don't see you? Time to put it in the computer and see. Well, she's gotta tail them, actually. Dang, they don't realize this one car has been following them this whole time. Dang, you just missed your chance. Oh, it's... These were walking right towards oh, you. Shit. <gasps> and you got this jerk. Oh, they popped your tire. Hey. What the... Damn. Now you're trapped out here. Yeah, see, I knew they had to have known she was following them. I mean, that was a long drive. And then you pull in at the exact same time that they do at the diner. Pretty bad. Pretty bad. 
there a motel within crawling distance? Uh, the only place near here is the Cedarwood Retreat. That's really more like a rehab place. Oh, that's where Maisie is going. Uh, Kyle, that's my uncle. He says someone hired the entire complex for the weekend. A whole place? Now you know. All the staff sent home. So it's empty. Yeah, no Ultra eyes. Private. No eyes. The whole place for like one person the whole time. Yeah, amazing. Any clue who the one person is? You don't know, but you know. That's where that 30K is. You were right. I'm a man's the shot. Mm -hmm. Thumbs up for the pecan pie, Jesse. We ate to please. Hey, no, no, no. Come on, come on. I just got here. You want a soda or you want Maisie Day? Yeah, that's what I thought. You guys splitting that 30K. 15K each. That's turned off. It was worth a shot. Was it? <laughs> what if it would have opened the door? <laughs> Come on. No one's hopping this fence. <laughs> what is this, Jurassic Park? How sure are you she's in there? Very sure. 85%? 85%. Maybe 80. 80. Come on, give yourself more credit. 90%. Is that Witty's car? Oh, he's in did on it too? Him? No, did you fucking tell me? No. Uh-oh. The 30K is supposed to be split between y'all two. Now a third person. Hey, a ladies. A fourth person. Where'd you put it, huh? Underneath my seat? Wow. It's gotta be Maisie Day, right? Huh. This was my find. Yeah, I heard of this place. Let's find a way in. If anyone dies in this episode, I'm banking it. I'm banking on it that it's those two. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Ladies first. This is trespassing. But the people inside, they don't own this property, so they can't really do much. How's that sound? What is that sound? It's like a power tool. Am I expecting like a dark, twisted turn? Is he carrying a rivet gun? That's a gun. Fuck. That's the guy who slashed my tires. Busy days here. Oh, it was like a power tool. I thought it was a gun. Okay, my friends, that's Dimitri Babbage, specialist doctor to the stars. Babbage into, like, holistic voodoo or some shit. Is he even a doctor? For Hollywood, just about. <laughs> she must have been desperate to call him in. Yeah, because she's going through it with hiding a very big secret. But why the hell did they need a power tool? Okay. All right, Maisie is by herself. They chained her to the bed. 30 grand. Yeah, split. Chain? Looks like Babbage shackled her up for the cold turkey. Illegal Hector. Uh oh, she's playing rescue. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. This is so wrong. <sighs> Dang, guys. Jeez. So much for sexy shots. <gasps> You gotta go. Guys, can you just stop? Yeah, relax, relax. Shit. Okay, we're gonna get you out. Why is there goats in there? What type of rehab is this? Go! Run, run away! Stop with the photos. What? Full moon goat. Was this some demonic stuff going on? Oh! No! She's a werewolf. She got bit. She's a werewolf. Oh my god, what a plot twist. What a plot twist. Leave, leave, leave. That is why she was chained to the bed. Oh my god, she's a werewolf. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Oh my god. Yep, yep. What did I say? What did I say? What did I say? What did I say? Those two. Those two. Dead. Gone. Ew! Yo. Oh my god. She's unchained. Leave. Shit, shit. We gotta go. Whoa, I was not expecting this. Called it. Called it. Oh! Left your boy there to die. <laughs> Yo, I did not see this coming. That is wild. 
You gotta take off your backpack, man. He's dead. He's dead. Oh, there it is. What are you doing? He shot her with a million inch bow. Wow. I called it. I called it. I didn't call it, you know, being a werewolf. Amazing day. This episode is about a werewolf. Did not see that coming. Get in that car. Oh! Wow. This werewolf is on a killing spree. That's what the goats were for. God damn. Oh, they're running to the diner. Damn, Jesse. Good to know. That's what you ought to call that pecan perfection. Oh, Jesse's about to take out the trash. Man, please don't kill Jesse. It's not about frying chicken. You know, you're gonna saute it, you're gonna bake it, you're gonna... But it's gotta be done, you know, because you, know, you undercook it and, you know... Oh my God. People die. Tell them, tell them, tell them, tell them. Ah! What is... Hey, good, good man. Man, have your gun ready. You see what they're doing? I will momentarily, man. What but first? Fucking call for you help. need to calm down. Just tell them what you saw. What has happened? Then maybe we can figure out how we're gonna move forward. No, for just you. please, just call for help. It's I right there. Oh! It's right there. No, 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 Oh man, he was he, he was a good guy. He was a good guy. He made that pecan pie. Jesse. Oh, it's right there. It's inside. <gasps> oh no! no. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> She's brave. Are you taking photos? Oh no! 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 It took him. Oh! And he shot him. Wow! There's a gun. Use it. Grab it and use it. Grab it and use it. Come on, Bo. Don't miss. Don't miss. Ooh! Nice shot. Well, Maisie is dead, and now you have a photo of a werewolf that is worth millions of dollars, and he got the shot. 30k to yourself. Not 15k. 30k. Damn, dude. Oh. She transformed back. I wish I would have saw that. She transformed off screen. Wow. Kill me. She did a hit and run. Got out the car. Got bit by a werewolf. No one's gonna know that true story that she hit, did a hit and run. And that's what led to her being bit by a werewolf. And it's crazy. We thought it was a human. She hit a wolf. And you thought the whole hit and run thing was what was causing her, you know, bad flashbacks. But it was the fact that she was transforming into a werewolf. Oh, wow. That's the last shot. That's the end of the episode. Yep. <laughs> yep. Wow. Did not expect that, man. <laughs> that was shocking. And that is Maisie Day. A short runtime. The shortest runtime, I believe, of season six of Black Mirror. But what do I think? But I need to hear your guys' thoughts. So sound off like you usually do. Um, with this episode, I enjoyed it. Um, but with the ranking, I'll tell you guys that right now, I have number one at the moment, uh, episode one, and then episode three, and then Lock Henry, episode two, and then I'm going to put this one in the fourth place spot for it being the fourth episode. But I enjoyed this episode. I've enjoyed all these episodes, but wow, I was not expecting this to turn into a whole werewolf situation. I caught on as soon as I saw the full moon and she started freaking out and I was like, oh my God, 
Really? A werewolf? Nothing with technology in this one. Um, I mean, other than, you know, downloading photos and, you know, the whole paparazzi thing. But with Bo's character, looks like she's going to get more than 30K. I mean, that photo is super big. That's going to go viral. Maisie Day, an actress, a high profile actress, runs over a wolf. But you think it's a human, but it's not. And then she actually does the right thing and goes out to go check on a person, but it's a wolf. And she gets bit and she, you know, does a hit and run, which is crazy. And then you pull up to the scene with her and she's like, all scared like what is it and I'm like hmm she's feeling you know the guilt of hitting a person but nah it's just you know an animal got hit by a car go about your day and she knows that but she's going through the dark flashbacks of the past situation over and over again and then to find out she's seeking help but <laughs> we're thinking that it's because of her drug addiction as she was on shrooms while driving, not paying attention to the road. Goes to this off-site, everyone is out of here, very private, and they decide to use power tools. I thought it was a gun at one point, and they lock her to the bed. And then you, they pull up, the paparazzi and Bo pull up to the scene, there's a goat in here, why? I guess the goat was for, you know, feeding but once i saw the goat i was like some demonic stuff going on here what could this episode be about and she starts transforming into a werewolf and kills those guys and then it goes on a killing spree Bo and the other photographer played by danny ramirez go to the diner leading that werewolf to the diner and it murders people i mean that cop should have you know got the message if i see people you know taking you know, stuff and blocking a door, something bad is about to happen. But this cop is totally clueless and everyone dies. But luckily, Bo gets the gun and shoots the werewolf by the end. And now she's rich. Crazy. Crazy. But I don't know how they're going to, you know, come up with the story of, you know, that Maisie hit a werewolf, got bit by a werewolf. That's how she changed into that. I don't know how, but, you know, it's going to be viral. People are going to know that werewolves is a thing that's out right now. People are going to be on high alert because this is just one. I'm pretty sure there's more. So that's wild. But at the end of the day, Bo gets back into the swing of things, you know, after leaving the job and seeing how horrible it is to celebrities, getting back in and then seeing how the job is still horrible, but at the end, it got you paid. That's crazy. I can't wait to see other people break down this episode. I'm pretty sure there's many meanings to this episode, just like the previous episodes before this one. But that concludes this episode. One episode left, episode five. So we have to reel that in. You and me here at Reel It In Reactions. Like this video, thank you. Smash that subscribe button. But most importantly, click that notification bell so that you guys are ready to reel in the final episode of Black Mirror Season 6. This is Reeling in Reactions. I'm Reeling in Miles. Thank you always. Peace.